Flower Science, we are going to see how 2024 is treating you and how it looks like in the near future for you. We will try to predict some things that you would benefit from knowing. Hmm. We are going to see first Pisces, the Wheel of Fortune. Okay. All right. The Wheel of Fortune, the Three of Cups, and the Queen of Swords. Okay. You're trying your best to come out of any bad luck that you faced in the last year. And in this year, you are trying to make new friendships that are more grounding and better for you. They might be at work that you are making these friendships and messages for 2024. What do you need to know? Okay. The hooded man, the hanged man. No, not the hanged man. This is the... What's the word? God. <laughs> hmm. Okay, so you are taking a reprieve from the people around you and you want to... The hermit is definitely looking like you need space and to recollect yourself and uh, the creativity. You are coming to new decision making and new plans for the future. It very much seems like you want to take control of your life this year and rather than messages, this has been what you wanted. Now I'm trying to get messages for you, what 2024 uh, brings for you in lessons and what you need to know about that. Mm. Because of work, one person that you are attached to they kind of aren't really giving you that much time, so you want to um, communicate this with them, and it would be better for you to talk things out so you know uh, they know where you are coming from and they know that you are feeling left out and some general messages for you in 2024 before we move on to Cancer. This is definitely a soulmate for you and this person wants to understand you, wants to love you but there is some miscommunications and some lack of communication that you need to resolve before you transition, before you move into the next phase of your life together. You need to communicate these things and establish a grounding for communication and um, a level of understanding between you two. Now we are going to move on to Pisces. No, sorry, Cancer. <laughs> this was Pisces. How has 2024 been treating you? It's, it's come with really quickly things happening, for me at least. I don't know, um, comment what your experience has been. Cancer, mm. the Knight of Pentacles, okay. You are definitely making big moves when it comes to your finances and you really are trying your best to make a lot of money this year and it is coming your way. Mm. The Hierophant, it definitely feels like destiny is moving you towards new money-making prospects and it seems like you are going to flourish more and more with time and the strength. Mm. What you wanted for yourself, it's taking time and that's the strength, that's you need to summon up the strength to have patience and deal with that. Mm. 
fulfillment and this year will, will definitely bring you a lot of soul nourishment and that means that you would be open to um, harmonizing yourself with the circumstances and the new people that are coming into your life and how um, there are a lot of people who are your well-wishers and they want to share compassion with you you will have an easier time connecting with them this year and some last guidance for you abundance it very much looks like this year is yours for the making and you have a lot of luck on your side so make the best of it the abundance is very much looking like you have already made connections that will help you in your abundance and really making a lot of wealth so make the best of it and now we are moving on to scorpio scorpio are their readings are always very interesting i find and i have a lot of scorpio friends um who always say that the reading was their situation so i look forward to their reading mm -hmm. Okay. The Ten of Cups. There is. Hmm. Okay. You have loved someone and. This has turned into something better for you, and you find yourself being able to love them as much as you wanted it's hard right now with the six of swords to deal with certain things and differences that naturally come between two people with the three of pentacles it looked like you are both ready to move on to the next phase and you are good for each other when it comes to finances but there are things that you need to resolve there are differences that you do need to talk about which you kind of put off and because you don't want to upset one another or at least it's this perception that maybe this person wouldn't like me as much if we talked about this if i told them how i feel and that's not how relationships really function properly uh, for the long term we have to talk about things even if they're difficult but it's understanding that Maybe the other person isn't giving you the room to communicate, very understandable. And if you are in that situation, um, also even then communicate, but there are sometimes people that we just can't and that definitely comes with a lack of comfort in the dynamic and the lovers. Okay, Scorpio, Five of Wands. Mm, there are definitely things that need to be worked out. And you hesitate too much in the dynamic and so do they. You both kind of feel um, like you are walking on eggshells with one another. Even though you have a lot of feelings and love and you want to share compassion, you do. But there's also always some... And that's not a definitive always, it's just how it's been. Um, you both feel like you don't want to say certain things that might you perceive that might upset the other person it won't because the other person is also doing the same dance that you are you they want to please you so it looks very much like you both are just doing an unnecessary dance around each other you don't need to and the spark of life there is a lot to look forward to in this dynamic and in this year there are things that they're really coming your way you should um just be ready for them and this person you definitely need to take the time to communicate with them they really really want to make this work i hope this helped and i hope you listen to this and start communicating with each other have a great year which has already been two months in <laughs>